Well, we were talking about tyrannical governments early in the program. Sadly, we were talking about our own. If Elizabeth Warren and uh, her party gets to regain power again, you know, if you're in Iran and, uh, you know, we, we talk about empty scamps and tattletales, they're not a huge fan of it. Uh, so we have this video that, that has come out, and now it, it really, there's not even a debate any longer. Iran shot down the Ukrainian passenger jet. Yeah, it looks like with two missiles. Yeah. Shot at it twice. By, by accident. Mm-hmm. Now, yep. remember, something I still don't understand. They didn't mean us any harm. All right. Okay. Right. Uh, just they br- were just they, they throwing were just, brush back. It was pitches. a brush back. They didn't mean yeah. us any harm at all. Uh, it's just when they thought one of our planes was flying in in retaliation, they shot it down. But they don't mean us any harm. Even though that I mean, plane a, left their airport and right. was going the other direction. Right. I don't know. Well, Bubba, it, it's bad, you know, to, to, uh, to be in Iran and be the person who actually shot the video. That's actually worse than being the person that shot the missiles, um, because now you've ruined Iran's and all these tyrannical governments. You know who just make up you know news. Oh, I'm sorry, we're doing that now. But uh, you know they they were denying that they shot it down, but now this video shows clearly that they did. And Greg said they're now looking for the person who shot the video. Is that correct? Right. Do they have him? I they just heard that he was is is arrested. Or is going to be arrested. They're going eh, not not good. Not good if I heard down the way in. If that. the Iranian government found out you're the one that shot the video that's out that everybody sees that you, we that they shot down a passenger jet. Uh oh, that's uh. Mm. And look, it it was accidental, but it was because now only the Democrats can take this and blame it on Trump. <laughs> right, <laughs> they're doing it. They're they're, they're well, saying sure. that Trump kills Samanali, whatever his name is. Yeah. <laughs> And then, because he he was just this hero. I mean, we even heard Chris Matthews referred to him as Elvis uh, or Princess Da to the Iranian people. Yeah. Of course, yeah. you see a lot of uh, Iranian people who can speak freely saying just the opposite. But yeah. anyway, so so we were hard. We just we we shot this great upstanding upstanding world citizen, and so Iran gets mad because it's just like somebody shooting Elvis or Princess Da, according to Chris Matthews. How does anybody even work another day after making a statement like that? But anyway, so really, <laughs> the fact that Iran fired on our U.S. forces and in, in the Iraqi base, it's really Trump's fault because he killed this wonderful citizen that upset the Iranians, and they fired on mm-hmm. us, not meaning us any <laughs> harm, of course. Right. And then – even though they were firing missiles that didn't even go where they were supposed to, meaning they didn't know where they were going to go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but about but they yeah. but they meant us no harm. Pretty high failure. We hid. Right. We had yeah. a heads up. They didn't mean any harm. And so, um, so then the fact that they thought we were retaliating, even though there was a deal that it would just be a brushback, so they could save face. Right. <laughs> I don't know why they think. Who we're, did hey, did we ever find out who made that phone call to go? Hey, we're about to launch y'all shelter. But hear hear me out. If this was all arranged for them to save face, which is why not retaliating was right, why are they shooting people down? Uh, because they shot people down because, oh, they thought it might have been one of our planes coming to retaliate after they fired on us. So if, you, if you're doing Democratic history and Democrat reporting, I'll tell you who shot this plane down, Donald Trump. Well, Rick, you know, it's, it's amazing to me that they have the technology that they could control these missiles within – you know, just a few hundred feet of where our troops were sheltering as a brushback pitch, but they couldn't track an airliner that took off at their own airport. Thank you, Bubba. Well said. And notice that it was going the other direction. Well, it was just a brushback. Well, how about how about a brushback for the plane? Bubba, they didn't get one. Bubba, it was all arranged so they could save face. And it's a uh, and um and we, you, by the way, you, I heard one report, I, and I don't know, you know how all these things start mm-hmm. flying out. But I heard that he was on our terrorist kill list, that anybody could get a shot at him was supposed to take a shot at him. And you know when he was put on that list? During President Obama's term. Mm-hmm. Right. I, I don't know. That was just a report that was out there. I have no idea. Bubba. Th- I wasn't in on the conversation. Bubba, th- this is like some foreign uh, leader taking out Jimmy Hoffa, okay? And then we start pretending like he was a hero. <laughs> and, that, and then that everybody loved him. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's uh, so, so anyway um, – that's uh, that. It is official. Iran. I mean, this this video shows two missiles taking down. Look, they thought they were getting retaliation, and they shot down the wrong plane. Now Not- the plane was climbing and going away. I don't know how you well, determine that is an attack coming in. A little gray on that, but um, well, Bubba, as you and, said, and Rick, it looks like now with the latest uh, 
you know, radar images and satellite footage that we have, the plane was hit, and even it didn't blow up immediately. I mean, I don't know what was going on on board, but it tried to turn and return to the airport, and that's when it blew up. Well, after the second missile hit it? Yeah, probably. Probably. Yeah. probably. Yeah. Well, your, your point stands, and that is Iran is so precise about their brushback. Right. Now, we got some scuds we took out of the, down in the basement, and we just fired them off into who knows where. Okay. But it was just a brushback. They never intended to hurt anybody. Right. Uh, they even told us what they were doing. They told got, us it was coming. To, so yeah. we could hide. Mm-hmm. And then, because it was just a brushback. You know what? They, they're just they saving face. Rick, you just don't understand. Right. Now, for some reason, in all this wonderful planning, they didn't know when a Ukrainian passenger jet was leaving their own airport. Uh, and they did not seem like they would have you know some kind of printout on that. There they are calling right now. They have the ability yeah. to do it to do a brushback, and they have the ability to make sure no American troops were harmed because they never intended that. Right? They didn't want a war. They, you know what they want to do? <clears throat> well, I don't know. Maybe they did. Now we yeah. were told by some people yeah. they did. Some. They oh, didn't. oh don't, don't forget! Know. Don't forget that moment when we were told that we don't give them the war they want, but what they did, they never intended us to wage war on them. Well, if they needed a war, then they would have tried to kill people, so it would start a war, and then that way their people would concentrate on us and not concentrate on overthrowing their government, which we've been told by Iranian people they do. You know how you so can did solve they want a, a war? Or did they want a war or not want yeah. a war? <laughs> uh, apparently, I'm going to go with wanted one because they shot down a plane they thought was coming in, Okay, and, and which means they thought they might be at war. Uh, so, so I, I mean, I'm just working through this. I'm a C student from Calhoun County, Alabama, but I, you know, I can, I think you can throw stuff on the table and even my old goofy self can figure it out. I think, I think I got it, but maybe you've uh, got a lot of people with their finger on the trigger and ain't got a clue what's going on. Yeah. So anyway, uh, but the, the big, the other point is if you're the video shooter, Iran either has him or is are looking, they looking for, for or they're looking for him, and that's you don't want to be in that situation. There's more footage coming out today. You see that launch. It's a you know that other was kind of out in the country. It looked like, but this other was a, a shot from a security camera. I think shows the missiles. Rick and Bob.